Today we will talk about a useful user script. And if you go to Extensions, Open Studio User Scripts, Alter or Add Model Elements, and it is called Merge Spaces from External File. This user script is very similar to doing new Open Studio model from Wizard, but it's if you want to use your own template files as a sort of library to begin the project. So right now we have an empty template file here. Rather, the template file is empty of geometry. If we go to the inspector tool, we can see that this template file does have space types. It has schedule sets and constructions. And it also has loads, but it does not have any geometry. Now we have another file that contains the geometry. And this has just geometry and space types. We can look at render by construction. Look, it has no constructions. Render by space type, it has no space types. But it does have spaces and it does have geometry. So we can look in the, the inspector tool and we can say, see that it does have 48 spaces and we can clearly see that it has geometry. So in order to merge these two, the one with the geometry and spaces to the library template file, we would just open up the template file, which we've done, and we can save this template file as um, our project. We'll just call it project. Save. And then you can go to the extensions tool, open studio user scripts, alter or add model elements, merge spaces from external file. And from this, we will just select our OSM file that contains the geometry and spaces only. And we'll click open. It says the spaces have been imported. And sometimes this takes a while. Okay, it says it was completed and it had has imported the information from the geometry file. I'm not sure why this is here. It must be left over from previous time I had run the measure. Let's check it out. So now we have the geometry imported into the template file. We can look at render by construction. We can see that there has been a construction applied um, and that's probably because in the template file, under our default for the facility, there are default constructions, space types, and schedule sets that are applied. If we look at the space rendered by space type, it'll probably say all of these are the default space type, which is a Lodge bunk room. Yeah. So <clears throat> now that we've imported the geometry, um, we can go through and start assigning space types to our model. So, for instance, this would be a. I'm sorry. Go to render by surface type and we'll select this space here. It's a kitchen and we can apply a kitchen space type to it. And if we go back to render by 
space type. And see that this has been the space type of kitchen has been applied to this space. So that is how you import geometry into a template file that contains all of your constructions, schedules, loads, and space type templates. Alternatively, you can use the Open Studio Measure. First, let's take a look at the geometry tab on the template. Again, this is a template file, so it contains all of your schedules, materials, loads, and space types, but it does not contain any geometry. If you go up to Components and Measures, Sorry. Um, if you, so if you if you go up to components and measures and apply measure now, you can download a measure from the building component library. It look it's located under whole building space types, and it's called the same thing, merge spaces from external file. So you can input the file path to the Open Studio file that contains your geometry for the project. And you can select any number of options for importing that geometry. And that would be how you run the measure in Open Studio. Thank you. Please like and subscribe.